Good morning, everyone. Dr. Vicki here speaking to you as the sun rises on the Seeds of Transformation Healing Center. It is Thursday, December 21st, and the moon is in Aries. The moon does shift uh, late tonight into uh, Taurus. That doesn't happen, though, until 9.51 p.m. here on the east coast of the U.S. For So for all intents and purposes, we're running... Uh, a very active uh, Aries moon. So today is um, the day that the sun moves into Capricorn. That's happening again late tonight, uh, 10.57, I believe. Let me look at my notes. I did make notes. 10.27 p.m. on the East Coast. Um, so that is the uh, winter solstice here in the Northern Hemisphere. The the summer solstice, congratulations, in the, in, the, in the Southern Hemisphere. Did I say Southern Hemisphere? It's winter in the North and summer in the South. That's what I wanted to say. If I didn't say that, it's okay. I only had half a cup of coffee so far. And uh, it's pretty cold. So as soon as I moved out here, my mind sort of, my brain said, Don't, wouldn't they rather look at the Christmas tree? <laughs> anyway... Um, yesterday I spoke of an opposition between Venus and Uranus, and uh, Uranus isn't done uh, creating <laughs> havoc, as it ever, ever is, honestly. Um, we have Uranus making an inconjunct to Mars today. Uh, that's a little bit... Uh, the, um, the opposition between Venus and Uranus is a pause like it's an opportunity to like look at something and be aware um but the inconjuncts are more crisis producing and require adjustments to be made this inconjunct is an inconjunct um that's called a, a, a waning inconjunct meaning that the adjustments that need to be made are coming from the outside and so you might get flack from the outside knowing that you have to make an adjustment in the way that you go about doing something around issues of freedom, around issues of uh, being different, perhaps. But it, it can be, in conjuncts tend to uh, come up on you, uh, you know, kind of when you least expect it, in a way. Um, so uh, be aware today, it's, it's not the best aspect for things like driving and, and uh, people dealing with their, with their anger. So know that that is a possibility. <clears throat> now, now that's actually happening um, soon, uh, 9.44 in the morning. I think it's about, I don't know what time it is actually. Uh, <laughs> but that's going to happen today. Uh, <clears throat> we also have... A lovely sextile between Mercury and Saturn. Uh, Mercury is our mind. Saturn is the structure of our consciousness. It's also about structure. The sextile uh, that we're seeing is one that supports progressive change and humanitarian endeavor. So we might actually hear about some humanitarian aid or some sort uh, reaching the people who need it. But in our own lives... It's really about, um, you know, luckily most of us aren't in that situation, but um, <clears throat> for us in our situation, it, it is an opportunity to both stabilize the mind and utilize it in a way that's going to be uh, better for all of us, uh, including the person, uh, excluding us, us, we, me, me, and, uh, and humanity. So that's kind of cool. <clears throat> so... Um, I'm going to be doing um, um, a video today on the, the solstice. I'll put that out in a little bit um, when I get inside and I uh, and I thaw out. But um, so I'll talk it more length about today. But uh, and do a reading for this season. So um, I'll do a card reading. All right. So that's that's what I'll do. You can keep your eyes peeled for that. Otherwise, have yourself a great day. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's winter. Well, almost not quite. I can say it's winter tomorrow cause it'll really be winter tomorrow. All right, guys, much love and, uh, take care of yourselves. Namaste.